What's up, everybody? We're here at, where are we at? Tell me where we're at. We are in Pleasant View, Utah. Wait, I gotta flip this. Hold on, I gotta flip this camera. I'm, 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 I'm two timing these cameras right now. Hold on. No, you're good, you're good. Pleasant Grove, Utah. All good. We are here, Pleasantville, Utah, touring Clearwater Distillery. Pleasant, Pleasant Grove. Yeah, Pleasant Grove. Pleasant Grove? Pleasant Grove, Utah. Yeah. Just outside Salt Lake City. And we have met some wonderful people out here. Some gentlemen, family owned business, Clearwater. It is a Clearwater Distillery Company. They make some unbelievable spirits that we're going to share with you guys today. Just kind of, kind of wing it here. We weren't planning on doing this. Figured, why not give it a shot? Just gonna have a good time here. Right. Well, it's, yeah, it's the middle of the day. Actually, it's three. It's five o'clock back home, right? Two hours. It's five o'clock somewhere, I'm sure. You know what I mean? As they say. So we're gonna do a couple cocktails here. We're just gonna try a few of the favorite stuff. A Pinot Noir, Eau de Vie. Oh. Huh? Eau de Vie. Eau de Vie. Sorry. Pinot Noir, Eau de Vie. This is not even bottled. You see this? But this is out of Mason Jar. Right. And Mason Fresh and new. This is a prototype. It's made from Pinot Noir grapes, right? Fresh, distilled. It has its own little process here that they're still experimenting with. Right. And once they figure out exactly who they're going to share it with, they'll let us know. Until then, we have a first time opportunity here to use this stuff. And I'm excited because I'm just going to figure out, I wish you could smell it, because the smell is really good. Let's give them a smell. Go ahead. That's it. Yeah. 80% of oh, smell is those guys. Right. And then I was born with and you got a, smell And you got a schnauzer over there, that's for sure. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. How's he so... <laughs> <laughs> I'm growing, I'm growing into mine. Your ears and your nose never stop growing. Remember that. <laughs> Somebody said, how's he so shiny? He, he uh... That's a skincare routine. Yeah. All right. So the first thing we're going to do here, we have some ice with the ice in here. We're going to try this with the... We're, we're, one thing we don't have out here in Pleasant Grove at the distillery is ice. So what they had to do is they had to go to the mountaintops of the mountains out here in Utah. They got this snow from the top of the mountains. So right. We're going to go with that. Okay, sure. Okay. Put that in there. All right. Right? Go pee on your water. Love that. Yeah, we're going to do a couple. You know what? I'm at the right place. I'm at the right place. You know why? Why? Because it's plenty of this. Plenty. So right there. We're not running out. We're going to make more than one. That's not one drink, by the way. That's going to be used for a couple. Oh, wait. No, let's, let's, let's lower the music a little bit. It's a little hard to hear you, supposedly. The feedback we're getting is it's hard to hear you. If you can just lower it a little bit. That's better, yeah. Subtly in the background. How's that sound, guys? Uh, Angelo, thank you for the tip, my man. That's awesome. Really appreciate that. How we been? We've been great, guys. We haven't been on live in a while. This has been a couple weeks here. Right. A little simple syrup there. Try that. Everything's fresh here. Everything's made, made to order. So this. Yep. Okay, That's simple syrup. You know what simple syrup is? It's sugar. You never have too much sugar. And this. Here's what we're going to do shake this up. The shake, go ahead. Shake it? Yep. Happy Thursday, guys. Let's go. Happy Thursday. Sounds better. Perfect. Minor detail. Let's put the cap on. This is live here, people. This is all live. Nobody saw that. Don't tell anybody. Listen, it's okay. This is part of the, uh, part of the process. Where's my strainer? Here we go. Okay. So we're just going to try this. This is a first time pour. Okay. Thirsty Thursday. That's right, Dad, Pod Dave. And 
I'm going to top it with a little club soda. Okay. okay. There I it is. Our master distillers aren't mad because we're taking this beautiful spirit that they just made. I'm going to try it. Go ahead, try it out. You know, I'll tell you if it's good or not, right? Because if it's not good, I'll tell you that. Well, you made it, so nobody else to blame. Well, I got to tell you, you know what I need? Tell me. I need in here, I need like a big ice cube. I need some ice on top of it. Well, here. This. And no, not, not, not that. I need a, and we don't have it here today, but this tasty. Mmm. Try that. I, I can't. Thank here. You. Try that. What's not the like about it? It's pretty good. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Mm. I'm trying to think what you could add to it. I, I, it maybe some, some maybe some fruit. Maybe some fruit in there. They have fruit. We're gonna well, a little grapefruit juice, juice in there. Here. Check this out. My right, second attempt. This bottle. Check this. Are we in Salt Lake? We are nearby Salt Lake. How far are we from Salt Lake? About a half hour. So if you're in Salt Lake, definitely stop by uh, Clearwater Distillery here. Could y'all please make apple juice? We actually have a, a gigantic distiller right there making apple cider or it's uh, there's apple cider in there Giant, it's fantastic this is the clearwater crew guys over at clearwater distillery fantastic place this is their home everybody's there there he is this is their home guys <laughs> yeah people behind the plan here just made this it's again not for market it is prototype it is Nick's Hard Cider. And it's fantastic. And you, we tasted it right from the vat over there before. It's delicious. Fantastic. This guy is going to go meet this guy. Oh. So Nick is going to go say hello to Renee. And we're going to make a nice cocktail. Whoa. Over. Check this out. So this is all clean. We have, again, our, our fresh uh, mountaintop snow. Okay? You only get this in Right Utah. from the mountains. You only get this in Utah. So fresh. And I normally don't like to shake, um, you know, whiskeys and bourbons, but because I'm going to put some fruit based into it, and see they have a stopper here. It's, it's for the the pour. Each one of these little stoppers is supposed to be like an ounce. Is it an ounce pour? I think it's yeah, half ounce. ounce. Yeah, so this gets in the way of. This is why I don't use these things. It takes away. It takes time. I wish we didn't have to either. A lot of history. A lot of history. <laughs> I want you guys to check out online. I'm not even going to tell you the story. Truth is, I know some of the story, not the whole story. Check out this bottle. Go to their website and read on about the history of this World War I veteran and his impact to where we are today and how the military and some of the respects that are given to the military because of that man. Okay? I'll let you guys tell me what you find out. Okay, right. so now I'm going to take from the Rene, which is a, a rye, um, we're gonna take some of the secret weapon that Nick made. That's a hard cider right there. It's a hard, it's a hard apple just cider. Splash it in here. It's delicious. Yeah. yeah. Can I use more? Yeah, I don't care. No, not yet. Okay. I think if we use this, we don't want to use too much of this. We want to take this. Yeah, save it up. Yeah, save it up. Save There's not enough here. How great would this be hot? If we made this hot with a caramel ring, with a graham cracker crust, Pretty delicious. with a cinnamon stick in it. Somebody asked, are you in Pleasant Grove right now? We are actually yeah, at right now. Clearwater Distilling come in Pleasant by. Grove. Come on by if you're in here. Make sure you uh, put that cap on there. There you go. Caps on here. And I'll tell you what, you know what got me? Because I thought I had the right thumb on, finger on it. Right, right, yeah. Um, no, we're not from Utah. We're just visiting right now. Just visiting. Just saying. So if you're from the area, let us know. Say hello to our friends. Emmanuel, thanks for the uh, gifts there, my man. Appreciate you. 
So this is all what we call research and development. R &D. We're testing. We're just trying things out. We're trying to see what you gotta taste this. Come on, Nick, come over here. You're, 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 you guys got both of you guys, Matt. Try it. Come on, I'm on. Johnny, Steph, come on. Everybody grab so your grab your glass. Here. Steph. Thank you. His head is an egg. Well head's an egg. That's a little that's a little mean. Okay. So let's be honest. Cheers. Let's see. It's all I guess the cameraman doesn't get any drinks. That's okay. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> We're not afraid here. What do we think, crew? A not very sweet Manhattan. That's a good consensus there. Because it's not that sweet, but we are missing. If we're going to make it right and put on a rock glass, we'll put a Luxardo cherry in there. It's a fall dress it up. Yeah. A little fall Manhattan. Fall Manhattan. I like that. I like the combination. I wonder what that tastes like. They were born right here. The two of these were born right here in clear water distillery. Wow. Okay? Look at that. And you got to respect your spirits, sip them, take them slow. Luxardo would be amazing. Oh, the cherry? Sweet. Yeah, that one. That was yeah. Mm. All these great ideas. So many ideas. This is the think tank. This let's see if I can read. Let's see if I can read some questions here. This is where the spirits are born. How do I get into the alcohol industry without prior experience? Oh, YouTube uh, University. Yeah, for one thing. Come back. YouTube University. Matt says. Well, I'll tell you, as I came in from 25 years of software, didn't know a thing about distilling, <laughs> but I figured it out. Took a few years, did a lot of reading of books, did a lot of watching the videos. And hey, you know, just a little time and practice, and you can actually make stuff work. And look at this man now. Look at him. And you've got to know when to ask for help. That's it. That's a big point. Yeah. Yeah. And by, and by the way, just so we're clear, Stephanie and Matt are husband and wife, been married for a very long time, have a great relationship, and obviously a very successful. This is their legacy, this is what they're creating. And anyone who's in this area, you got to come by and check it out. Tell us, tell me different if you're not impressed with some of the spirits here. Yeah. The next step one that we're going to use. Oh, we got another drink coming. I have Lorenz. That's how we say it on the East Coast, Lorenz. How, do, how, does, so any, how does anybody else say it? Lorenz. Price point of Lorenz is very reasonable. And you can do a lot with it. Um, primarily, it's, it's going to be in that category. It's going to match up best with probably, um, you know, like a rum, like a spiced rum. Right. Um, and so you can mix it with a lot of different things. I like to drink it straight. You guys can figure it out for now. Oh, we have a question. It says, where's the cameraman's drink? I agree. I don't know. I don't know where it is, but it's gone. It's gone missing for sure. I'm doing all this work. My shoulders are burning. Check this out. Cloudberry Preserve. I don't know. Oh, I got a drink. Brother, brother, John, brother John introduced this to us. Little Cloudberry. Anybody know what cloudberry is? There's Cloudberries are an Arctic fruit. They're only grown in northern climes, and uh, those are from Finland. Whoa. These are from Finland. Let me get a little taste of that. Wonderful. That taste the cloudberry? Yeah. Just They're very good. Just, 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 yeah, just, yes. just a little sample. Uh, the cameraman gets to try some things, too, huh? That's how I used to feed him when I was a baby. Mm. Uh, the airplane. Here, That's really good. Here, Johnny, comes the airplane. All right, so. That would be great on, like, a toast. Mm. Well, wow. Good sourdough. Try oh my god. Do it in here. We don't have to Want do some it sourdough? I wish um, we had cubes, but we don't have cubes. So again, we're gonna, this is just all r &D. We have rustic mountain man ice. We have ra rustic mountain man ice. So now we're going to take rustic our friend Lorenz. We're going <laughs> to. Oh, perfect. <laughs> it's an ice pick. Yeah, watch out. Love that. <laughs> Nick, this is Utah. One, one of the most intelligent men I've ever met. Educated me today. Just carrying a blade like that. I guess they think so. Now, Lorenz, you gotta check out the history of Lorenz because interesting because you said this is from the Arctic. That's right. And Lorenz's you could not have story, a check out Lorenz's story. I'll just give you a little sneak preview of this guy. Kill the polar bear. That's it. That's all you need to know. Kill the polar bear. Six, seven, kill the polar bear. So, you're gonna want to. Check out that story. So now we're gonna drop. So Steve says, I love this shit. Ounce. Been in the spirits industry for 15 years and your channel rocks. Half ounce. Love hearing that. Half ounce. All right. Just a little there. So that's how many half ounces is that? Half, half, half. Right. It's one and a half. Very good. So I don't have a uh, we're gonna, is there a stir in here? What kind of liquor is that? Somebody asked. 
This is called this, Rene, so it's a, oh, you just use well, a This Lorenz is, again, what they specialize here at Clearwater, uh, our friends at Clearwater. Did I mention where we are in Utah? Clearwater. That you need to come down here and check us out? Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is a, a blend. This is one of the specialty, iconic brands that they have here. And they take a lot of pride in this. And, and what I would say to you, the best way to truly understand what it is, is to get a bottle and sip it, put it on ice, and then try to pair it up with some other sort of fruit. You can muddle some fruit down the bottom of this, which I, I, I'm certain would be delicious. Uh, for the moment, I'm gonna use my ice pick. Just a light dagger. Where are we? Like we are. Halloween. Where are we again? Pleasant Grove. Pleasant, Pleasant Grove, Grove Utah, Utah, guys. At Clearwater Distillery. That's where we're at. What liquor is it? This is called Lorenz. It's a specialty liquor. What's it? Almost like a uh, rum, right? To a rum. Closest yes. to a rum. So think of a rum. Right. Add some apple cider to okay. the fermentation of that rum mixture, and then distill it through cinnamon sticks and vanilla beans. Love it. Gin and jam. Love that. I wish I had more of this. We got, we got to let you guys taste this too. John, why don't you taste this? You didn't have anything before. This is your creation. Yeah, and be honest, because again, we, we know we part of the story is we get it right and do it again. If not, we go back and join, but there's no wrong ending here. What are we thinking, John? You like? Oh, that's great. Great. Is it? Seriously, no, it's really good. See that? Yeah, you got cloud berries, you got chocolates. And he knows. This guy knows. That's it. What is the price point for Lorenz, somebody asked. Okay. So price point of Lorenz, I believe on the website, is $35. $35 for this. And I'm, the bottle, it's, 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 worth, it's worth trying it. It's very different. And when you compare this to other price points, I think it's very much in line. But there's a story. Read the story about the man that this is inspired by. Okay, that's yeah. pretty important. Um, and then you have the other connection of this story. We're out here, we're doing our thing in Utah. We flew all the way from New Jersey. Let me tell you something, it was, it is coast to coast. You can't get nonstop travel. We had to do our thing, you know, planes, trains, automobiles. Although we didn't go on any trains. <laughs> or automobiles. We didn't Oh, we did have a car. We didn't so we did the automobile and the plane thing. A couple of connection points. So anyway, this is worth it. This is a really nice spirit. You need to add this to your bar because you don't have this in the bar. There's no chance, okay? Johnny drinks need to come to Vegas. It's only a four hour drive, we've just been Vegas. told. I saw that's 15, uh, Route 15 South. That's right. right. All right, I'm gonna go. We'll be there soon. Okay, I'm gonna go sometime. This, this guy right here, today I love, love his story. Um, anybody who's respectful and proud of the military would appreciate the backdrop of this Nobel Prize winner. Right. Do you know what I said? No low prize. Money. Interesting. Check it out. I'm going to tell you the whole story. You check it out. How strong, how strong are these bottles, somebody asked. Uh, I think they all depend. What, alcohol content? Yeah, these are pretty much similar, right? These are 42%? So they're, they're about 40, 43. 42, 43%. 42 on the Rene. Price, point, price point on the Rene is? 95 on the Rene. 95, $95 online. So this is more of a specialty type of bottle. Uh, but again, you buy it, you have a story, you share it, you educate your friends a little bit, have fun with that, have conversation. This you will not be disappointed with. You just you won't. I'll put this up against some of the other, the other spirits coin. that I've had. Find yeah. the gold coin. Oh, go get the other bottle. Go get the bottle. Go get the, <laughs> go get the unknown bottle. I gotta show you guys this. I'm sorry, I don't mean to make you run and go get it, but I gotta show you guys this. Stay with us. So we have uh, Nick's hard cider. We got this here, right? Guys, if you want to grab some, just just Google Clearwater, uh, and then Google either Lorenzo or Renee. But for right now, I did not put the uh, the link in my description. I apologize about that. Okay, so so check this out. This is one of the coolest things. You have you have this bottle that is covered in wax. Okay, under here is a coin. It's either copper, silver, and there is one gold, 18 karat gold coin for those of you that know who Willy Wonka is and the golden ticket when you find that gold coin not only is it worth money because it's 18 karat gold but you have to DM us there's a whole nother little tale you get you might just as for instance you might get a tour out here mm. Clearwater, you just might you might get your own personal tour 
with Johnny Drinks. Oh. Maybe. Maybe. Not sure yet. We're still working on it. We'll figure we're it still out. Still in the marketing, and research, and development. Hence why we're here. But so watch this. This is so cool. So this ribbon, you pull up, okay? And you're gonna tear the wax. See what's going on here? Could you imagine if the gold coins in there? Oh my All God. Right, so, <gasps> no, sorry. Johnny. No. Johnny, it's copper. That's okay though. So check that out. You guys see that? We see it. So now we pull it back down on this side. I love this. Who doesn't like taking things apart? I mean, look at this. This is so satisfying, right? You get to peel this off. Look at that. Good stuff. And this coin is going to come off. And then we're going to save these coins because these coins are going to all add up. Now, this is the copper one. The value is probably similar to that of a penny, which, okay, not a big deal. Pennies add up. Let's see if we can do this. There we go. Is Lorenz a good ice and sip kind of drink, or yes. is it more of a cocktail? Lore oh, there we okay. It's Resounding yes. It's ice and sip. Goes well with a cigar, I've been told. Yep. Renee and Ap, they all go amazingly well with cigars. All right. Pair it with the cigar, guys. You heard it here first. You guys see this? See that coin? I don't know if you can see. I don't know. I don't know if you can see Renee on the coin. Nobel Prize winning. Okay. Can you see that? Right in the top. Goes in there. You take, you collect, you hold on to these. And then, and again, you buy these bottles, there's a gold coin in one of them. And what are the uh, odds is that one out of every... Uh, 3,000. We have about three, a little over 3,000 in the thousand. batch. That's so, a number one coin. That coin has the number one minted on it. And so once we go to batch one, two... Let's, let's explain to let's, yeah, yeah. Explain to it. So this coin is number one minted. That's explain right. it to us. For sure. Up here above Renee's head is the number one. So this is batch one of the Rene series, which is a 30-year-old Armagnac blended with American rye whiskey. Oh. It's, an, it's an incredible blend. It just goes together so well. But batch one, like we were saying, just over 3,000 of these has the number one minute above his head right there. Mm. So that's all there is. This is a solid copper coin. This is not one of those zinc copper coated things. We really wanted it to be a nice coin. Right. Um, 15 of these bottles have a sterling silver coin mm -hmm. and then like we were saying, like John said, right? 18 karat gold. It's a $400 melt value coin uh, with the number one on it. There's wow. only one in existence. Only one? Oh, I didn't realize that. We gotta I didn't realize that. There's only one it. around, guys. So. Batch, two, batch two has the number two on it. So the batch, the number one coin. There's only one. Oh, we got to find it. That's it. Somebody's so got to grab it. that. Somebody's got to grab that gold coin. And you are in for an extra, extra special tour of this place. Yeah. That's so, guys, true. if you want to check that out, check out Clearwater Distilling. Uh, Renee or Lorenz, they have a couple different products. Just Google Clearwater and you'll be able to find that. If you have any questions, feel free to DM us. Um, but I do not have the link in our uh, live right now, yeah, so I apologize. Just live, just have some fun. Where can I buy a bottle? Yes. Yeah, so, actually, on the website, it'll tell you, right? right so, go right on the website. There's a... There's a text message code, I believe, you can type in. So you can buy it from the website, or you can yeah, text buy it right from there. To nine two six eight four eight. All right. Uh, do you guys do case pricing? We do for distributors. Here. All right. So if you're a distributor, let me know. Shoot me a DM. Commercial account, yep. Yeah, commercial accounts. Shoot me a DM. We'll talk about it. But that's uh, we'd love to uh, discuss that. It's Big fan from Texas. What's going on, guys? How much you said the gold coin was? The gold coin is worth about what? Well, the 440, value, right? Down, melt, they call it a meltdown value. It's over 400 dollars. Over 400. It's more than that because the people that yeah. made it make Super Bowl rings. That's right. We Whoa. Got, so the, all the silver coins and the gold coins got made uh, at a jeweler who actually makes Super Bowl rings. That's awesome. So the, the cost to us, our cost that we paid to make that coin was 1400 dollars. Oh my God. What an investment. But it's, it's it, it, but if you get it, it's invaluable, guys. But this is where I, I, I gotta tell you. And, and Johnny will say this to you, we, this is our first time meeting and, and having the opportunity to come here, right? It's the first time. I opened up this bottle at our home because they were kind enough to share a bottle with us. And I love the fact that it had the wax top. I had no idea how much it was worth. I had no idea what kind of real spirit it was other than the hint that it was a rye, okay? You need to try it. And if I'm mistaken, you don't enjoy it, just let us know, DM John. But this is worth the value of it, just entirely in how much work went into it. 
You have this beautiful rye, you have the history of this man, Rene, Nobel Prize winner, you have this coin on top, you have the wax spin. Just, just give it a shot, right? Great gift yep. for somebody. Holidays are coming up too. That is the Rene, guys. That's Rene from Clearwater Distilling. I see a lot of questions about where you can get it. Uh, Google Clearwater Distilling and it should come up as the first search, whether it's the Rene or the Renz. Um, you can order right from the website. So whether you're in, I saw somebody from Tennessee looking to grab some, you can absolutely do so. Um, if you have any questions about it, all right, 47 states they ship to. Awesome. What else are we doing? I think Let's that's, uh, maybe tonight when we, uh, yeah, so maybe we'll go live again later. We'll oh, right. We're going to Sundance. Dinner at Sundance. Oh, Dinner at Sundance, 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 guys. So this is our first, this is, uh, yeah, we have one day in Utah. Maybe we'll go live again later. Maybe we'll make a video. Who knows? Um, if you guys want to check it out, like I said, Clearwater, Google that stuff. Try out the Renee. Try out the Lens. Let us know how you feel. Love we it. will be back very love soon. It. Let me love flip it. this around one time. Come in here with me. Let's take a picture. So I can get my... Hold on. Oh, oh. How do I flip this? Yes. So that is it, guys. We will see you very soon. Thanks for checking in, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate you. Later. Appreciate you. Let's see, how do I turn this off now? It's all right, yeah. <laughs>